Hello, I'm Pat Cashman. Philips Healthcare has asked me to present five short, fun, informative videos about automated external defibrillators, or AEDs. You know, those devices you've seen them in airports and malls, but figure you'd never need to use one. Because what are the chances that someone is going to suffer a sudden cardiac arrest right in front of you, right? Well, the bad news is it can happen to anyone, anywhere, anytime. The good news is there's something you can do. And I'm going to show you how easy it is to set up, to use, and maintain an AED while enticing you to watch with a little of this eye candy right here. Yeah. Okay, enough of the eye candy. Now, question. What would you do if someone dropped of what appeared to be sudden cardiac arrest and it was right in front of you? Would you be a zero? Or a hero? The thing is, a lot of people don't do everything they should do when they are faced with a sudden cardiac arrest. They might think, Oh, I've got a hair appointment. Somebody else will get this. Or they might be worried. What if I hurt the person? Or what if I get sued? Or more likely, they might justify their actions by believing, Hey, you know what? I called emergency services. I did my part. Okay, so that last incredibly handsome guy did help. But you can't stop there. Every minute that passes decreases a victim's survival chance by nearly 10%. So, for the best chance of survival, you need to respond immediately. Calling emergency services? Essential. Starting chest compressions? Great. Finding and using an AED? Perfect. Don't worry about hurting the person or ruining their clothes because their heart has already stopped. Trust me, I can always get another shirt, but I can't get another life. And rest assured, existing U.S. laws protect Good Samaritans. Studies show that AEDs are a crucial tool for treating sudden cardiac arrest. In fact, the most important element in the treatment of SCA is providing rapid defibrillation therapy. So, check out the next video. See just how easy it is to go from ordinary to extraordinary. Do it for your friends. Do it for your family. Do it for your co-workers. Hey, do it for me. You know, this old ticker hasn't been feeling so great lately.